Hello my friends! Today happens to be probably one of the more exciting videos on my YouTube channel for me personally because I am doing a swimwear bikini haul but not just any swimwear haul. You'll probably be able to tell somewhere in the title or description of this video that I am doing a haul on my own swim line which I am so excited to share with you all. As you can see by the tags here on my swimsuits. So I actually shared a few months ago that I was going to be launching and starting my own business. And just because I haven't posted about it in a while on YouTube doesn't mean I haven't been working on it diligently. It has been my biggest project the last few months. I'm not sure if you've been keeping up on any of my Instagrams, but if you are following me on Instagram, then you'll know that I started with like a whopping 10 followers on my anime swimwear account. Uh, and we're up to 400. We're slowly but surely growing. Uh, hopefully by the time I upload this video, Video, uh, we should be at a bigger following with more support and I mean it so much when I say each and every one of you who support me who have been with me through this journey it really really means a lot to me from the bottom of my heart I really put my heart and soul into this project and it's just the beginning I have big plans for this swimwear line as I stated in the beginning I really wanted to approach this in a way that would represent high quality and something I'd be proud to have my name on so I can promise you that these swimsuits are very high quality I didn't go like the wholesale route and just purchase a ton of swimwear and just slap my name on it I had a hands-on say with the type of fabric that I wanted to use the colors the designs So I'm just really excited and proud of the finished results I'm starting off with the California collection and so it's just going to be four sets for now I'm already getting started on the next collection that I have coming up But with these sets It was really important for me to create designs that were timeless in the sense that I want these to be suited that you can wear years from now it's not like your one and done trendy swimsuit that you look back a couple years from now and you're like why did I get this? No, I want these to all be staples with colors that will still be in style. Because it is a luxury swimsuit, you are going to be paying a little bit more money for it than you would at just a regular swimsuit that might not last as long. Again, it's just a much thicker fabric. It's a higher thread count. Overall, it's just a really eco-friendly fabric. So without any further ado, I can't wait to dive into the sets and share with you all the designs, the colors, the details, and the specs. I am so happy with how everything turned turned out and I can't wait to be releasing these. I believe the launch should be going up on May 13th. So if you haven't noticed already, I'm actually wearing one of the suits right now. It's the one piece and I'll share like shots of what it actually looks like on all the other models as well. That way you can do kind of like a body comparison, size comparison of how it might fit you. This bikini right here is actually going to be called the Beach Comer. It is a one piece black swimsuit such a staple if you don't have a one piece in your swim wardrobe then this is definitely going to make a great addition i really love this one because it's not too low cut but it's not like super high up here so it's still really flattering and feminine and I made sure that this suit does have adjustable straps because I wanted this to be one of the more diverse swimsuits as far as I want this to really go well with every body type, whether you're short, tall, petite, larger. This is supposed to be a suit that really fits every body type. And we do have sizes from extra small to extra large. I do want to introduce a wider range of sizes in the future. And as far as the detailing, this does have ruching on the side, which also provides a lot of flexibility and wiggle room if you want to cinch it really tight or if you want to keep it kind of loose you can really kind of adjust the length of the one-piece bodysuit and then you can also adjust the shoulders right here go ahead and pull one from the rack and show you the detailing up close but as you can see we have some gold hardware and it just ties and you can see the cinching along the sides right here so beautiful and um, it is cheeky coverage and that is something that I really wanted for this set because when you think of a one piece sometimes women can associate it with something you know that's not as flattering that's as boring that's too modest I think this is a perfect combination of modest and cheeky because it covers so much but then you also have a little bit of fun in the back so I think it's just such a flattering swimsuit overall also if you aren't already check out my website animeswimwear.com if you sign up for 
Diana Swim Club, you can actually get free shipping on your order no matter which set you pick or how much you spend. So definitely take a look at this. It is such a beautiful and thick fabric. The fabric isn't thin at all. You can just really tell that the quality is there. One thing I really, really side note wanted to do is make sure that there weren't any cutaway tags. I hate having cutaway tags or when you're wearing a swimsuit and the tag is like sticking out or if you cut it, there's still a little bit of fabric there. So for the label, I made sure to do a heat transfer label. You can see right here, it just says anime swimwear and it's not going to bug you at all. As far as like care and wash instruction, if you're still wearing the swimsuit when you get home, just hop in the shower with the swimsuit on and that's how I usually wash all my bikinis regardless if it's mine or not. Just usually bring it in the shower with me and hand wash it and then hang it along the shower. I wouldn't really recommend throwing something uh, this nice into the wash with a bunch of different colors and different fabrics and textures. So if I were you, I would just bring your bikini into the shower when you're done with it and just wash it with water and make sure it is cold water as well. So that's the Beachcomber set. Also real quickly, I wanted to share with you the packaging. So if you do decide to order from Anime Swimwear, your swim set will be sent in this beautiful, beautiful banana leaf uh, print box that I actually designed. Honestly, I would totally reuse this. It's such a cute box. So all of the fabrics for my swimsuit are the same for this collection. So it is recycled yarn, ultra chlorine resistant, sunscreen and oil resistant. It has muscle control coverage and it's pilling resistant. So essentially it doesn't collect a lot of fuzz or lint. Okay, up next we have the Doheny set and this one holds a special place in my heart because it's the first one that I picked out and designed. I decided to name it the Doheny set because Doho or Doheny State Beach is actually where I learned how to surf and this is my first swim set. So I thought it kind of went hand in hand as far as first for everything. So this is definitely a more revealing set. I will admit this is the most revealing uh, swimsuit set in the collection. If you're feeling really bold, I definitely think this is something you can feel really confident in. It is more of a thong style bottom and it is in the color white sand. Um, it isn't like a full white, but honestly this fabric is just so soft and buttery. And this set does have padding, whereas the Beachcomber, this one doesn't have padding. I didn't really feel like it was necessary because it's already so secured. And honestly, I hate padding in bikinis, but with this one, I felt like it needed to be more secure just because of the style of the top. Obviously, I'll be sharing pictures of what this bikini looks like on, but you can tell that by the sides here it also cinches in and kind of has that ruching design but I really really love about this set is that the padding is stitched in so it's not going to move around a lot it's not going to fall out if you wash it it's going to stay nice and secured in that bikini top I also don't want there to be any confusion when putting this bikini set on so when you put it on it should go on just like so and you will have to adjust the straps. You will have to kind of pull the strap backwards and then once it's on, you can tie it on your back. So just make sure that when you get your bikini set or the Doheny set to adjust the straps, sometimes the straps come in and the loop is like this big and it's just all you need to do is adjust it. So again, we have the print right here. Made sure to do the heat transfer label. You don't have to worry about a cutaway tag sticking out or showing through the fabric of the bikini. And yeah, this is just such a staple. Again, my whole design and purpose for these swimsuits is for it to be colors and just suits that you are going to wear in the future. I don't want this to sit in your wardrobe and get donated the next few months. These are suits that are going to stay in your wardrobe for years to come, take with you on vacation, uh, going to the beach, going to the pool. So uh, these are really meant to last you for a while. But I don't think I'll be trying on the bottoms here on this YouTube video just because they are really cheeky and I don't want to get flagged, but I'll share photos of what it looks like. But obviously you can tell that it is a thong style bikini. I must say this makes your butt look really, really good. So if you're ready for a 
some hot girl summer or you're just ready to show off all your hard work you've been putting in um, or if you're just really comfortable these are really fun and sexy bottoms okay as much as I genuinely love every single one of these sets in this collection this next one has to be my favorite hands down by far and it is the Laguna set I am just so obsessed with the color and the design just everything together I wish I could have this swim set in every color possible maybe one day I'll introduce it in other colors but it is just such a pretty design and it looks so good on all the models you tried it on okay so let me break down this set for you and share the details so these are the bottoms my heart I'm just so in love this design is absolutely my favorite by far in the collection I'll probably be wearing this bikini set every single day this summer. Anytime you see me at the beach, I'll probably be wearing this set right here. I just think it's so feminine and so fun. Here's the detailing of it. As you can see, it just has this ruffled lining and it's really stretchy, so you don't have to worry about it not fitting you. Just follow the size guide on my website. It'll fit, I promise. Like, I would be surprised if these didn't fit you. They're just so stretchy and comfortable. And again, it has that same thick fabric. Really really buttery and soft and then the color is just gorgeous it's so pretty for this one I decided to go with medium coverage this is kind of like a coverage that's not gonna look like granny style but it's not gonna be thong style it's literally like that perfect in-between coverage I definitely think that this is a really flattering bikini for all shapes and sizes whether you have a smaller bum a larger one it'll definitely look really flattering okay and this is the top the Laguna top so it's really kind of hard to tell the design I think just by holding it up like this so I'm obviously going to be sharing videos and photos of what it looks like on um, but you can cinch the front as little or as much as you want it you can extend it out and have a little more coverage or I believe the model that uh, wore this in the photo shoot really cinched it so that it was really tight but kind of thinner on the front or you can have it larger so this is perfect because if you have like a smaller chest area or smaller bust size then you can cinch it really tight and if you're larger up here then you can open it up and it'll still give you excellent coverage it's really supportive of the girls because of how many different straps there are you don't have to worry about your boobs going everywhere when you're on the beach or when you're going swimming this is a really secure top so yeah, that's the Laguna set. Last but not least, we have She Who Has Not Been Named. I've been really debating this. I think I want to call this the San O set. I'm not too sure yet. This one is definitely your more clean, basic, staple bikini. It's real simple and sweet, and it's really flattering. It doesn't have as much of a design like the Laguna set does, so this is going to be like your standard bikini. And I picked this color because I just really love the neutral colors on this one so this is the top and again I just can't wait for you all to feel the fabric on this it's just so soft and so stretchy yet it's very supportive so I am actually a 34 C and I found that I like the size small top although I could go medium I just like the size small better uh, same with my friend Abby who modeled this during the photo shoot she actually is a 34 C and she liked the small but you can really go both ways the medium still fit me really well so this color is just this really pretty sand nude and what bikini occasion could you not wear this to you can wear this to the beach if you're going on a trip on vacation you can wear this on your vacation trip if you're just going to the pool with some friends you can wear this it is just such a staple piece really clean and simple again nothing crazy going on but it's just really high quality I love the bikini bottoms on this one so I would say that yes this is kind of like your thong cheeky style but it feels like it's a lot more coverage once you actually wear it. My friend Angela wore this in Hawaii and she said that it felt like it was great coverage, like it was still a super cheeky bikini, but it didn't feel like everything was exposed just because of how secured the threading and the stitching is on this one. And I love that it's so simple, it just has like this little cross design. So this is the front of the bikini and this is the back of the bottom. We have our anime swimwear 
kind of print right here and again we have extra smalls all the way up to extra larges just so pretty i love this bikini it's such a staple okay my friends that is it for my bikini haul my swimwear haul for the day i hope you all enjoyed it so much leave a comment down below which set is your favorite or which one you can't wait to get your hands on if you aren't following the anime swimwear instagram account make sure to give that a follow sign up on the anna swim club for free shipping on your next order we do launch on may 13th so inventory is plentiful until we run out these are limited collections so if there's a piece or design here on this video that you saw that you really want to get your hands on make sure you place your order right away i'm trying to do it to where new designs come out with every collection i don't know if i'll be restocking just yet that is it for my video today i hope you all enjoyed it so much keep an eye out for that launch and until next time i'll see you guys in another video soon bye